Hey, what's happening, y'all? Once again, it's your boy, Rod Thomas Jr. from the real new behind the new. Oh, yeah, the date is still the same. Uh, February 3rd, 2019. Um, man, it's crazy. We just put a video up. Well, we showed you all uh, a, a video that was recorded uh, uh, approximately, we just going to say, 36 hours ago. Where you had the Shreveport Police Department here in Shreveport. Had to come downtown and beat two Negroes up that was beating each other up downtown Shreveport. But here we are now. If you look in the description section of this video, click on the link. We got a whole hostage situation here in Shreveport, Louisiana right now, actively. Uh, let me see what time it is. Um, I think, I don't know what time it is. We, we got, it's about four something here in Shreveport, which is Central Standard Time. You got a whole hostage situation where you had Negroes firing at me 13, 14, 15 shots in an apartment complex. And we think one person got hit and all this. Man, at what point do we as black folks keep the police out of our neighborhood? You wondering why they shooting you in the middle of the street? Because I'm going to be real. Let me just keep this real. A lot of these people that supplying from the police department are coming back from these illegal wars overseas. We're going to start talking a lot more about that this week because that's what we, one thing we do. We talk about geopolitics. And if you don't understand what they're doing in places like Israel, Venezuela, uh, Somalia, Afghanistan, Iraq, you'll never understand what they're doing in your neighborhood. Now, in your neighborhood, you got some savage-ass shit going on. Y'all excuse my language. You got Negroes running around here shooting automatic weapons indiscriminately in broad daylight, shooting no matter where they shoot and innocent people getting shot. At what point do we as black folks step up and stand up and say, look, we're not, no longer going to let two, three Negroes in a hood of 3,000 people take our hood and hold us hostage no more. So now you got a... Um, a live hostage situation or standoff situation going on right now here in Shreveport. Y'all click on the link that I'm finna put on the, uh, I'm not even gonna put a description in it. I'm just put the link to the, uh, to the video where Alfonso Scott, which is another, uh, a good friend of mine who has another, um, independent, independent media source here in Shreveport. Uh, I'm going to put the link up to his page where we just went live and he's right there live. He's going to be calling me and we're going to be going live again. Y'all subscribe to our Facebook page too because you can get a lot of this stuff that we talk about on a day-to-day -day basis. And you can rest assured tomorrow I will be talking to the mayor, three, four of the city councilmen, three, four of the seven city councilmen. We, we, we got to figure it out. At what point though, now, now the new mayor, Adrian Perkin, he trying to get things right. But at what point do you Negroes want shit right? Oh, yeah, I got something on my lip. What point do y'all want something right for your own neighborhood, man? Come on, man. You niggas out here shooting indiscriminately, man, in an apartment complex. All these shots y'all just fired. And keep in mind, as I go live now, it's, it's still going on. They got a standoff right here in Shreveport. I'm going to put y'all in, in the mix with Alfonso Scott, my boy from the Justice Investigation. Y'all give me a second. Let me go and put this up here real quick.